Hi guys, welcome back to Zimzam Entertainment. <laughs> to my sub cousins. I got nothing but love for you guys. I got nothing but love for you guys. I love you guys so much. Oh, if you are passing by, please don't forget to subscribe. And of course, uh, click on the notification bell so that every time I post new videos, you get notified. And also on this platform, guys, no YouTubers left behind, which means any YouTuber out there, please subscribe to their channel as well. Guys, today's entertainment. <laughs> Another death. Guys, there's a death though. Hey, this COVID, this COVID. So the um the ambassador to Mozambique, hey, retired General Douglas Nikayaram. I'm gonna hey, I hope I, <laughs> this way. Nikayaramba. Okay, yeah. Because I was really going to just like butcher that one. Nikayaramba also succumbed to COVID. Guys, is it just me? Or does anybody has anybody else noticed that it's these retired generals that are succumbing to 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 to, to COVID? Hmm? And you know the interesting part is that they are the ones that participated in that coup, the 2017 coup, the the the, the soft coup. Hey, they they participated. So it, I think it's now four of them. Hmm? It's now four of them who participated in that coup. That have succumbed to COVID. You guys, really? Ah. Anyway, so the man passed away. He was in Harare on leave, apparently. You know, it's just this COVID, this COVID. Anyway, so it turns out that most of these top guns in Zimbabwe ministers or whatever who are succumbing to COVID. Do you, have you guys realized that maybe it's just me thinking that these people are dying because they're in Zimbabwe where there's no proper medical facilities or equipment. I, I suspect, I mean, I would think they have their own little clinic that has everything. I mean, being ministers, there must be a clinic somewhere that is just specifically for them. Most of them are succumbing to this disease, obviously, because there's no cure for it. And obviously, most of them have underlying conditions. But under normal circumstances, these people would have been flying out of the country to get medical treatment. But because COVID, no movement, <laughs> countries' borders are closing. They're, they're not, I, I don't think they're accepting people with COVID, except for this other one. The rumor, it, it, it's been unbelievable, that rumor, that uh, Taguire, Kuda Taguire, that guy, he was airlifted to Dubai. I don't know how true it is, oh, but there's a rumor that he was airlifted to Dubai. But if he had COVID and Dubai accepted him, eh, who knows? You can only say money talks, bullshit walks. Hey, guys, this COVID, this COVID is just, I think COVID is blowing in the wrong direction. We need to blow it to a different direction. COVID, you you you're going in the wrong direction. I don't I don't know. I you know I just feel like COVID is just moving in the wrong direction. It should be blowing the other direction. Huh? Why are you? Anyway, I said before in my previous video, wondering if COVID was taking requests. Looks like COVID still is considering my request. I'll leave it at that. All right, guys. Don't forget, subscription is free. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.